Welcome to the next in the monthly series of JS plugins that I'm doing. And today we've got a very simple one called Volume Adjustment. It is simple, but it is really, really useful. So as you can see, there's only a couple of controls on there. You've got an adjustment control in DB, which can go negative and positive 150, which is huge overkill. And you've also got a maximum volume. So it actually, that maximum volume is actually because this plugin acts as basically a sort of a safety sort of limiter as well as a volume adjustment. So that means that if you set it at zero, um, it won't let any peaks through the, that are exceeding zero dB. So, let's see it in action now. Let's set it to, let's say, minus five to start with. Okay, and we'll get down. Uh, Okay, and play something. So as you can see, the other thing it's got is a, a meter of how your input level and your output level. Quite useful. So, what would happen if I increase the volume of the drum plugin by a lot? Let's see. So notice how it's, it's actually clipping well and truly on the input, but on the output it's making sure that it doesn't get above 0 dB. Take this back down to a more normal level. Same usual thing, you can click on those to reset those clips. And you can, you can adjust the volume with your mouse. Or you can type in an exact value, which can be very useful if you're trying to do some gain matching or something along those lines. So, that was a very straightforward sort of plugin, but a very useful one. Hope you found that helpful, and look forward to seeing you tomorrow for the next one.